Hey guys, Austin here with Hope to Cope checking in today to remind you that you are a miracle and you have a purpose. So today I've been thinking about what to share today. What was my aha moment? But I didn't really have any. And I've been thinking about it all day. I got up this morning, did some Qigong. We went to SeaWorld today. I spent the day with family. And then came back tonight, we're eating dinner and I was talking with my wife and my niece about this idea. I'm like, I haven't really had an aha today. I don't really know what, what to share. And so we started talking about events that have happened today. And I said, well, the only thing that's really stood out to me is the jacuzzi, the hot tub, and the low water level <laughs> that's been bothering me. I noticed it this morning and I started to look for ways to increase the water level. And I found some hoses and different things, but there were signs that said, you know, don't touch it or it's a thousand dollar fine or things like that. And so I noticed it then when we got back this evening, still noticed it and there's a water slide, but the, the hot tub has to be full of water for the water to go down the water slide. And so I've just been thinking about it a lot. And then we even had my sister text the, the host and say, hey, you know, is there a way that we can increase the water level? Haven't really heard anything. So I've been thinking about this all day, haven't found a solution to it. And as I was talking about that, and my wife says, you know, that's, that's how I feel every day with us wanting to have another child, but not being pregnant yet. And so I'm like, ah, okay. So, so she feels this way. We had an eight year gap between our first and our second child. And we've been trying again now for a couple years and we're not expecting, we're expecting to expect. And so she says, you know, that's something I, I feel every day where I, I'm looking for something there and it seems like there should be an easy solution to it, but it's still not happening. So just like I wanted, I want the hot tub to be full of water, it's still not there, even though I've been thinking about it, pondering it, looking for answers, you know, messaging people, talking to people about it, it's still not there. And she's like, that's how I feel every day. And so you may be feeling that right now. There may be something that you want, there may be something that you're moving towards, and it's just not happening. And you think, you know what, there's, there's gotta be a simple solution, there's gotta be an easy way to make this happen, but it's just not happening. And you're finding yourself frustrated and, and stuck. And so if that's where you are today, just want to help you know that you were okay, that this life is a series of mountains and valleys, and sometimes those valleys last for years. Sometimes they last for months, sometimes weeks, sometimes days but those valleys can last. But just because you're in a deep valley doesn't mean it's the end of your journey. There's still hope. So keep moving forward. Because when we give up, when we say, you know what, I'm just not gonna try anymore, that cuts off the opportunity for things to get better. That cuts off the opportunity for possibility. And so just hope on. One more day, let's get through today together. And remember, you are a miracle, you have a purpose. It may be difficult right here in this moment, but just because it's diff difficult, it doesn't mean there's not things to be grateful for and to enjoy. It's just like my wife said, you know, that we have three other amazing sons that we get to spend time with. And she says, you know, I, I get to enjoy them, enjoy the moment, but still want for other things. You can still have that yearning, but still enjoy today and take that step forward. Remember, you are a miracle, you have a purpose. Thank you for being you. Remember, I'm here at Hope to Cope every day, checking in with a message of hope and to remind you how very special you are. So thank you for being here with me today and I look forward to seeing you again soon.